Georgia and Max, uh, thank you uh, for joining me on Press Day today for TED. Yeah, absolutely. absolutely. Glad to be here. Exciting times. You know, January 11th, right around the corner. I, I had the opportunity to watch a few episodes last night. I love it. Like, one of my biggest things is, like, I love the 90s. So going back to the 90s was fun to watch. Uh, what are you hoping for when the fans of TED tune in to watch this? What are you hoping to get out of the series? I'm hoping that people laugh as hard watching it as we did making it. Yeah. Half as hard. Mm -hmm. Like, we enjoyed shooting and and just the process of making this so 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 much and i hope that the people who watch really can enjoy it the same amount yeah i i didn't go to work any single day yeah. you know what i mean it was not work at all it was such a blast and uh yeah i think just like i think laughter and and just the enjoyment of seeing ted on the screen again i think that's a huge thing you know yeah. i think everyone loves him so excited how was it uh, connecting with these characters and bringing them to life between, uh, you know, John, of course, from the movies. Now you're go you're playing the younger version of him. And of course, Georgia as Blair. How did you uh, how did you connect with these characters? Uh, it wasn't that tough for me because John and I are not dissimilar in that we can be stupid idiots who dig our heels in about <laughs> stuff we're wrong about, like very clearly and factually. Uh, we tend to be wrong about different things, but generally the same amount and with the same level of stubbornness. Yeah. So that that wasn't too tough. The The accent was tougher than relating to him as a person. Yeah, I think for me, it was just again. Yeah, same same thing for me. It wasn't too tough. I've I've related to Blair on many different levels and uh, bringing her to life was fairly simple. And, you know, we just everybody on set was also so down to just be a family and and yeah. so that helped so much just jumping right in you know when you booked these roles did you go watch the movies just to get an idea how you wanted to bring these characters to life in the 90s oh yeah absolutely uh, yeah I, I i needed a refresher anyway i loved the movies yeah. when i was younger um taped it and then watched it kind of anyways because i was like mm. oh that's one of those that needs a rewatch and yeah. i just loved it you know if not even more than i did when i was a kid because you can you get the jokes a little more that's true uh but yeah no it was um i think you know i i did but i didn't need to do too much research per se i think max probably had to do a little bit more of the research side because he's you know playing young john yeah definitely a fair amount of research just watched ted and ted 2 over and over and over again mm -hmm watched quite a few other things to, to get examples of good Boston accents and really like yeah. let that permeate and and percolate. Um, yeah. That's, um, did you uh, speaking of Seth now, like how did you collaborate with Seth? Any pointers to playing these characters? And uh, like, I'm sure you guys were laughing throughout the set working with them. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. Um, no, I mean, he he pretty much trusted us a lot with our characters and yeah. and you know when he knows what he's looking for he knows exactly what he's looking for and if you audition and there's no second question there's no yeah. oh maybe it's somebody else then you pretty much have free reign to do what you want because the, he trusts you with the character so much i don't know yeah there was a lot of collaboration too though there's a lot of questions of how far do you take it how how much do i argue in this scene and yeah. so he was very open about that though yeah the collaboration was very much like he was down to like answer a question or help you flesh out anything on the fly at any time for sure yeah um last question favorite moment in the series about the 90s favorite moment in the series about the 90s probably uh john preparing to jerk it to Lori laughlin like john john sitting in front of the tv just getting so worked up about an episode of full house uh is pretty crazily 90s yeah oh man i really liked the corny prom it was the prom yeah. was very 90s um you know and that was fun to watch just come to life so i i think that that might have been my favorite Amazing. January 11th, Ted, I want to thank you uh, both for coming a few minutes today on Press Day. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Have a